Hey, this is Alex Power, and in today's tutorial, I will teach you how to create a typewriter effect for your video in Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2017. Let's get started. So I have my footage already on the timeline. This one is just a simple time lapse of the clouds and the mountains. Looks pretty good. First step, you will need to create a title. Just press letter T here and type in your message. I'll just put the name of the effect. Check the selection tool and scale this to the proper size. As you can see, this is a special font. You can just look and find similar font online. There is lots of typewriting fonts available out there for free. Now, next step, we will be animating this letters appearing one by one. For that, we'll just move the text layer to the beginning of the clip and we will cut here the remaining part because I don't want it to last for the whole length of the clip. Make sure you are highlighted the text layer, not the video layer. Otherwise, it won't work. The effect you will be looking for called source text. Create a first keyframe. It doesn't really matter if you do it in the beginning of the clip or you moving a little farther. We are going to erase this particular keyframe later on. Just a starting point for us. So move a little bit forward, like approximately halfway and make sure you have a selection tool here pressed. Just click on the text and click on the T letter. Now it will change the color to red. Go ahead and erase one letter T and you go three frames back. One, two, three. Now you erase letter T and then an extra letter. And then you go three steps back again. One, two, three. And this time you erase three letters. And then you go three steps back, one, two, three, and then you erase four letters. Each time one letter more. Let's do this quickly. I've experimented with that and I found that three frames works the best for this effect. You can play with the settings and try four keyframes or five keyframes or two, whatever you think works better for your situation. Looks like we lost letter T there. Let's put, oops, let's just put letter T there and I will create another keyframe. Now, if we play this back, it goes kind of fast. So in order to slow that down, just grab this boss clips, right click and nest it. Okay, now it's one sequence. It still goes fast, but now we can change the time duration. So right click again on the nested sequence, speed duration, and just do this at 25%. I found that this is working for me for this particular sound effect that I'm applying. Okay, it's slow enough right now. Now I'm gonna go ahead and grab my typewriter sound effect, which I found on Google for free as well. And we want to start our sound effect right before the letter appears here. And I think this is ready. Let's play it back and see how that looks. That looks great. You can play with the settings and speed duration of your clip in accordance with the sound effect you have. And this is how you create animated typewriter effect in Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2017. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, drop a comment, and press this bell notification button that you won't miss any of the future videos that I release on this channel. See you next time.